Hi, this is Wilkin from, from Spicin. In this video, I'm going to give a quick demo of the Spicin IBUS uh, usage. It's a free tool to convert the IBUS model into the sub-circuit Spice format, which can be simulated with free circuit simulators such as NG Spice, LT Spice, and our S Solver. So this is the GUI of the tool. The usage is very simple. User can first uh, take a look at the information pane and get the uh, uh, idea about what the tool is doing. Now, uh, in the IBUS file, there are two data, mostly. The first one is the RAM data. The second set is the IV or VT based data. For the free version of the Spice in IBUS, only the RAM data is supported. We do have the uh, conversion service to generate more accurate model using the IP based data. The next option are the type of simulator. You can either select the LT Spice or the NG Spice S server, which are Berkeley based river chip circuit simulator. One thing to note is that for LT Spice, it needs to be the July 17 version or newer. Next in the model pane, uh, first user specify the sub-circuit file to be generated. In this example, we will generate in the R drive. The suggested extension is either .cir or .zip file. This is not the SPICE file, this is the sub-circuit library. Uh, the test driver, which is a SPICE file, will also be generated and it will have the SPICE extension. That's why the suggested extension used here is either .cir or .zip files. Next is to select the IBUS file which contains the model to be converted. In this case, we have an um, example file from uh, Micron. If the model can be parsed successfully, all the included models in this IBUS file will be in here. Since we do not use the uh, official golden uh, parser, that means we have our own built-in parser. So if user gives a spice IBUS file but cannot see the models being indexed file, then something has gone wrong during this uh, parsing process. When that happens, we need the IBUS file uh, in order to provide the support. However, for the free web tool, the support is on the best effort basis. Next, user select the models uh, to be converted and then select the corner. Remember to add the, click the add to this button. Uh, a particular corner of that model within that file will be uh, converted into corresponding spice format. User may, may specify more than one corner to be converted at the same time. So for example, for this file, I uh, will generate uh, this two plus uh, different settings. Uh, so all this file will be generated into this library. Next, just click the OK button. You can see the circuit file has been uh, created. This is a test driver. This is the library. Let's take a look at library. There is a subsequent name. This is a model followed by the corner. The input uh, and output terminals are input, output VCC, VSS, and enable. It's all single-ended. You can see the second corner. This is the second uh, uh, models uh, being generated. This is the third model being generated. So all the converted model are in this library file. Next, this is a test driver. User will be able to use the specified simulator 
uh, to simulate this uh, file. So user can see it has an instantiated instance of the converted IBIS file and connect to the power supply based on the uh, VCC range uh, uh, info in the IBIS file. Connect the transmission lines uh, 50 ohms resistance and be able to run chain chain simulation. Next, let's uh, run uh, this uh, simulation. Uh, this is the uh, NG Spice or SS Solver compatible format, the one we just specified. So we should be able to simulate with the free uh, Speedlight tool. This Speedlight will uh, involve the built in SS Solver and simulate the Spice file. The raw file will be generated. This is the simulation data. As you can see, this is the input, and this is the output of the IBIS file. Similarly, we can use LT Spice to uh, generate the model and perform simulation. So let's do that again. In this case, we will specify the LT spice being used. Select the IBIS file. So the circuit file and the driver has been generated. Next, let's uh, uh, invoke the LT spice. So this is the output of the IBIS file and the input. So as user can see, even though uh, uh, we have only IBIS file, we have been able to convert that IBIS model into the SPICE format, which can be simulated with the free SPICE circuit simulator. Uh, this LT SPICE, NG SPICE, and S over can be downloaded from uh, the website uh, shown in the usage tab of this uh, free web tool.